Hi everybody, welcome to the latest fan cam. So before we get on with the fan cams, as usual, no, get downloading the One Football app. It is free. The link is in the description for that. All the latest news, your transfers, your gossip, stats with Newcastle United. Every football fan needs it. I see this in the preview for the games. Um, it'd be a perfect chance to bet him in and get him comfortable on the ball and things like that against a team like Huddersfield that don't have much confidence. He played. He, he, he was. He played really well. He. He had a couple of energetic runs, had a couple of chances as well. Maybe he should have converted one of them if I had to be harsh, but yeah, I was. Well, he played superb the day and more, more to see from him because he's, he's really fast, really good player. Oh, he's awesome, awesome. We've, we've, we've missed a player like that, someone who could literally just take the ball and run at players. Because we had Kennedy like that up until, I don't know, the Cardiff game, and then after that he's gone missing. It's like home alone. So now we've actually got a player that can actually do that, and it's absolutely amazing. Just give the ball to him, watch what he can do. And the thing, the thing that's so much better than Ben Arthur, because I know there's going to be so many comparisons, is that he tracks back. Can't tackle though, so he needs to work on that side of the game. But he tracks back, he stays in position, and that's what Rafa loves to see. He's a really good player. He looks, he's always looking to go forward, which is going to help us in, in games where it's going to be tight and we need that extra bit of quality. I, I can say Almer on stepping up in them big games for us. Yeah, I think it was the best player on the pitch by far. I think Perez, he doesn't offer anything at the minute. I know he scored, he doesn't offer anything. I think we should drop Perez, put Almir on and uh, maybe just keep bringing back up too because Perez didn't know to the squad today, even though he got a goal. And also the defence was a, didn't have to do anything really. He brings so much to the table. Um, yeah, he's, we've lacked that pace, especially down that side because we've got Richie behind him. We know Rich is not blessed with pace, so it's nice to have Amirin on that side who's got pace, Yedlin on the other side that's got pace, just missing a touch. And then obviously we've got Perez and Rondon. Oh, how good was Rondon today as well? Sorry, I know the guy behind the camera as well loves him as well, so... I'm did, gonna, did, gonna, did miss a couple of chances. He missed a chance, I did say that, he missed that chance at the end of the first half, but boy did he make up with it, straight out of the second half. Barely had time to kind of sit down and, and find your seats. Buried it in the bottom, bottom corner, 1-0. Amazing. and. I wasn't sure if there was a bit of a gamble, but if that's it to go off, then um, it looks brilliant. And I think I did mention say that he'd be better in his second season. And the, the money is worth it, Alma, and he's just outstanding. So that, that's, what New, that's what Newcastle need, needed, a player like him. He looks something, that lad. Very unlucky not to score the day as well. One off the post and the one where Kiba Nelly went right through his body until they managed to get it clear. But he looks something special, that kid, and I'm looking forward to seeing more of the lad as well. Oh, what, that dink over the keeper? Yeah, but you know what, you got to allow him on that one because, you know, his all-round play was absolutely amazing. Just linking up, always looking for the ball, never shying away. Uh, I don't think he even wanted to come off, to be honest. When Atsu's name went up, there were so many groans around me, it's unreal. Like, the fact that Almiron's coming off, oh, it's, it's a joy to behold. And to be honest with you, there's no better game that he could have started off yeah. against Huddersfield, do you know what I mean? Bring that on to, to Burnley now, let's see what he can do. Look at that Irish guy, he stitched those pants, look at that.